All right, y'all, so we're back with another one. And in this one, we're going to be checking out AP Bryn going against Onyx PH, man. You all were telling me in my last video back that AP Bryn got destroyed and Onyx PH has actually been on a tear. So I have a lot to catch up on. Let me know in the comment section what you all want to see me check out. And yeah, let's just jump straight into it. I really want to see what's been going on. You all say I've missed a lot. So let's see what's happening, y'all. And let me know how y'all been doing in the comment section. Let's get it. Sky King Kong. Hey, 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 hey. Are we allowed to say that? Sky King. It came from Renmar, though. Nice poke. <laughs> His intro got hey, some pa back and forth pokes going on. <laughs> Check out the emblem set that's being deployed by both of these squads. Again, it's not like Fnatic, Onyx, Lock, Fcap out of a good hero. Okay, so they're going to they're gonna fight for this first I class, first who, class. Say for sure. Coach, why not? Coach Hayes? Yeah. They were in control. Oh, speaking of Whoa. in control, Bruce. Mm. Bruce with the triple man knock up and King Kong's answers. With a steel cables. Ooh, Cyber first kill go to King Kong. He brings him down and Cyrus nice. picks up the kill. See, I told you, Mr. Perez. Wow. That's a local of uh, Signal Village, the gig. <laughs> About the same neighborhood as I have grow growing up. But anyways, regardless, see, I told you, they were in control. Little of the jungling game. going on right now. It's not like they gave F got bad choices. It's just they gave him choices that they were comfortable with. Yeah, it's actually comfortable. Uh, a comfortable pick for Few again uh, with the Faramis. A lot of times you see Few has those clutch netherrealm moments but wait a minute this king kong, king kong. Really <laughs> <Kyle's easy laughs> he out. ready look like he ready for smoke right now all right what's the thing they have a good initial setup coming in from brusco or uh kirk but the beauty is again super friends with the frigid glacier again oh so, yeah as a brusco if ever, they got a they got control they of the middle map right now it looks like wild charge flicker combinations or a glorious pathway coming in for flap oh. so oh. really need to make sure Kelra get caught lacking? Uh, ah, caught Kelra out. Uh, wow, well, just like that. This is one of the few times we've seen Kelra use the Claude this season. Off to not a good start. Uh oh, okay. Oh, King Kong. Good. Nice oh, objective secure. Talk. Again, shades of uh, what happened to uh, Kusei in the final two games. Kill for an objective, you know? Day. Again, when a Ling catches on you, and it doesn't even really matter who that gold leader is, helps that it's an early game spiking yeah. Harith. There's very little you can do, especially with a purify. It's a not bad. It's, it's a pretty nice game right now. Pretty good game. Now, in trade for that, it was a free turtle for Fnatic Onyx. Yeah, I think uh, that Fnatic Onyx really got what they wanted. Wanting to go for those turtle takes. Because, again, when it comes to their uh, graphics a while ago, the comparison between these two teams, in terms of objective controls, Fnatic has... Like the vision Bruce so goes getting right now? Want to, as much as possible, get neutral objectives get the lead early on to activate super like the information Especially he's gathering he has a winning lane matchup this is a harith that could dominate the early game Jose, you know what else they have the edge on fanatic onic have the crowd on their backs very rarely do you see and i see harith is in the gold lane now that wasn't the case last time i was you know i was active playing mobile legends and stuff y'all the harith i see is a strong pick in the gold lane these days Ooh. king kong is going crazy but to be fair, though, inside the venue here in Green Sun Hotel Makati, the crowd's leaning towards Penate, uh, towards Falcon's AP Brand. You know what? That was true earlier, but now looking at the crowd, I can't tell you. Who okay, who looks like they're going to get this. Game. Oh, no. Harith, you have Purify. And, yeah, just Marco standing his ground. Anyways, as I was saying, the, the crowd, it, it's, it's a full pack Green Sun Hotel, ladies and gentlemen. If you're not here, let me tell you, you're, you're missing out. So get your playoffs tickets now. It's, it's the, the crowd's quiet. I need to say, unfortunately, the grand finals tickets hey, <laughs> are sold out. There's a ah, he tried to take it. It's not a zero percent chance that they maybe open up a few seats, but I, I'm, I'm, t I'm telling you now, man, this is this is it's, it's sacred. This hall feels sacred, man. Yeah. People are just with bated breath just watching. Some of them are they're, they're, Dang. Those are again. Bro, I got all his health back. They, they really want to absorb whatever's happening right now. Whoa. Like a fast-paced play coming in from Brusco. And Few with a save coming in with the Nether Rub Super Prince. Who got it? Oh, Kirk. snap. Kyle Teasy got it. Did he use his Retri? But Kirk is yeah, he used Retri. So that's a free Lord. To the top lane, but they're not even done after a few. Another knock mm. Breeze, Double kill. Brusco was the one who got the kill. Man, fanatic on it. Got two kills. Let Anything that should be a free lord. A false engage like that, you would have said, "All right, let's move on." You know, turtle's still standing. Maybe we can go and get that. But Fnatic just understand the map so well. They understand their playstyle so well and how their opponents will respond. If anything, the more amazing. Yeah, Kyle isn't even going to challenge it. If you just <clears> stayed there, if you tried to fight it off, but Fnatic didn't budge, and now they got 
all those kills and the second turtle of the game. Man, we've been this has got to hit a thousand gold. But I have to admit, I I'm leaning uh oh, caught Marco lacking. Mmm, got him. Onyx, but in this case, it's gonna be super friends. Nice. Bring down bulletproof. When you have a lineup stacked like this, and your gold laner is known as a gold standard, like that's that's that that's to be expected, right? You can just leave him alone. Like you can say, all right, I'm gonna do this. Kelra, you know what to do. And that was a Claude that got hit with the first blood. Yeah. Like he he got he got it was unjust what, what happened to him right yeah. and then he's just like all right you know i'll just i'll, I'll control the lane again falcon's ab brand really uh, took advantage mm, took the tower okay. top tower <laughs> down they're gonna leave keller behind uh, but just like that even uh, despite the first blood right? attempt onto keller he's winning the gold lane matchup took down one turret already oh. here comes a pull onto kirk plus a stun onto uh -oh. easy but kirk when they got the catch is really tanky not, not afraid this is a lot of poking going on to just zone out uh, just zone out in dang damage Fnatic Onyx Philippines Up almost 3k in gold now. They might as well go to Professor X and say, you know what? We, we want to enroll. You know, at this point, are they gods? They're superhuman. They're superhuman. Gods, mutants, whatever you want to call them. One thing for sure is they have the longest streak. All right, checking out the items again. There's about okay, they caught Kyle. They caught Kyle, but he's get, he gets out. Out the Tempest of Blades there. Luckily, luckily, FCAP have two big front liners away no 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 Kyle oh no oh Kyle almost get get hit oh here comes caught again no beefy no tanky heroes for a no for Falcons AP brands Fnatic doesn't care a little Tagalog slip out yes it did I was just saying I agree with you Jose I agree with you the fact that I understand why you got a little perplexed there. <laughs> it's because how did a Grok just die like that? Yeah, he was next to a wall. Exactly. There was a Faramis. Uh, I guess, you know, few just deemed it necessary to just, all right, Ogwin is going to happen. Yeah. Just let it happen. He didn't even flicker. That's so your job. That supports our thesis of maybe they let it go in hopes of oh, mm. the turtle. Again, Cyric, Secure King the Paul. turtle. All of it. Secures the third and final turtle for Fnatic Onik. Still got the 3k gold lead. Once again, neutral objectives. 3k gold lead just about locked in. Look at the aggression again. I do like to commend how Brusco has been playing. One of the roamers that you know for a fact is not afraid to go for those setups, go for those pickoffs, no matter how down or how up they are right now. As Kirk trying to zone out Falcons AP Bren, they're not going to attempt on the purple buff of Kyle TC. So, so far, Falcons AP Bren can still. You know, a, a contest for the Lord later on, assuming Kyle Teasy gets his purple buff. That's right. You're, you're still looking at Kyle uh, on the Ling, and you're also looking at Super Marco, a Harith. We're still at about the mid-game, so you're still looking for a mid-game power spike. And if you watch the first series tonight, ladies and gentlemen, you'll know that a Ling-centric lineup yeah. is very capable of just suddenly bursting down their opponents. But at 4K down, the map not exactly being on your side and oh, oh, oh wait and and Kirk being such a nuisance oh there we go okay will be casted but all the way from the back line is the AOG super face oh my goodness and a killing spree on to flap easy they're not even done because they're going all in uh-huh oh double oh he's down coming in from triple catches Kyle easy that was a mm. that Brusco saved his way of the dragon to make sure to shut down the one above all. Brusco more like Bruce. Look at that. They're keeping the lanes pushed up. He used his I love it. They're pushing all the lanes up. He waited. He more than just waited. Definitely get another top tower at least and probably bottom tower. Yeah. Bottom tower's gone too. And the surroundings. And, and now I mean, he's pushing. He's going to get away with this. He's and top towers. Yep. <laughs> they just got both towers. Oh my God. Man. Onto that tower and sure that uh, fanatic that Brusco specifically was able to push. And they're going for Lord already. Brusco is doing everything for fanatic. BJ Paro, I told you, he's a mutant. And they're gonna get Lord. He's a mutant. He's a he's a he's an MLB anomaly. Look at Claude is melting. That's a Grok. Man, the damage output of fanatic on it just now. Claude is destroying already. That's crazy. Looking at the items. DH, it's a trinity. It's barely a trinity. Again. Mm. You know, the adjustments of the Claude. Not relying to the mana anymore. Not going to result to the com a common emblem. 
What's that? Has enough damage early on just with two items, but with three What's items. that, 7k gold lead? Again, that was an Ogwen with a mm. emblem, bes um, emblem beside a, a wall. It was a Grok. It was a Grok. Bro is going to make me burnt without the ult. Yeah. That's what it looked like. And clearly, Fnatic Onyx in control, approaching the 8k go uh, mark up on FCAP. Now I'm wondering, what's FCAP to do? Because obviously the whole single turn isn't working. Ooh, look at oh. Man. Yeah, it's pretty much getting to that point of no return. Just the knockoff alone from the Jeet Kondu might the AK gold stronger. lead. This type members. of a tower advantage okay. is crazy. Fnatic on it, controlling their uh, waves uh, beautifully here. They still have a Lord up top. As Falcon's AP brand tries to work on the level one Lord. The question is, will Fnatic go in? for the additional kills. Yeah, they won't force it. Fnatic Onyx are still respecting FCAP's output. And there's a conceal. What are they looking uh -oh. for? Here's the counter attack, and they're going to find Super Friends. He Bang! does have the first oh, so okay. He falls down in the hands of one above all. Kirk soaking up all okay, the fighting back. He's not going to be able to Double. sustain the counter attack of the bees. And this might be their opening. But King that was good. That was good. They dropped it from an AK goal lead back to a That's seven. Easy. It still goes in. Oh. You know what else King Kong knows? Is that his burst is on point now? We just a moment ago we looked at what Kell was rocking. What is King Kong rocking? Does he have the Sky Piercer? He has a BOD, that's for sure. That's what I want to know, because if he has a Sky Piercer with a 600, I just don't know what what more can you ask from this guy. King Kong has been phenomenal this. all season long. Ooh. Alright. I'm <sighs> I'm not a fan the expert. That was nice. Far from it. But did you see that ankle break in turn? Yeah. The velocity and the trajectory that might have been what caused that much damage. Literally the divert the fanny of King Kong has a, its own diversion. He he was he was like a, a swimmer, like an Olympic swimmer. He kicked off of the wall and right into Ogwin's face. Uh, Ogwin's back now, but still you gotta be really wild charge. Oh, wild charge out of nowhere for Blapnesi as well with the glorious pathway here. They're melting the tanks now. Oh, okay. Okay. This a wipe. Oh. Nah. Fanny almost got caught. Fanatic Onyx walking away with everything that they want, plus something for the road. The orange buff taken away by Kelra. What I like mm. about Fanatic Onyx is I believe we've highlighted four players. The moment that it looks like we haven't said Super Prince's name, he did an amazing job Don't with the Frigid Glacier. Don't forget about me. Four catching four members with the Frigid Glacier. Fellas, don't forget about me. Prince Ramirez, by the way. Look at that. Jose and he does not have. A okay. sky piercer! It's all physical penetration with this King Kong and even Kelra. That was so it was the mechanics. It was the, the whole fact that he pivoted on the wall. This might be crucial though, because Kirk, he has the taunt. And Brusco as well, ready to charge that wave the dragon and says they just poking away, poking away. <clears throat> okay. They the keep poking. Zoning. The members of Falcon's AP brand basics are enough. As his frontliners are waiting in the bushes. He's a right-click assassin. All right, let me tell you this now. They can't keep taking all them pokes. So they'll have to go back, or they're just going to lose the fight. Look look at his kit. Ogwin. Oh, no, they, they have the spell that heals him. An Athena shield, um, item. understandably, against Kirk and Prince. And then a Dominus Ice that he just barely built, like, a moment ago. That's why he, he can't do as much as uh, Zoan or be the frontliner for Falcons AP Brent, because at this point, Fnatic Onyx not afraid to cast their ultimates, even to Ogwen alone, just to bring him down. And now Fnatic Onyx really controlling the Lord Pit here. Here comes again! King Kong on Flaptizi trying to zone, but Kirk and Super Friends making quick work onto Flaptizi as they still hold the Lord here. Let's see if uh -oh. able, they're able to contest as the Glorious Pathway will be casted as well. It's going to be a Retribution Battle. Oh, Fanny wins the Retri. Again, the Frigid Glacier combination will connect along with the Blazing Oh, Duet, to find That was a trade. They almost got it. Might be worth it for Falcon's AP Bread. I almost one. survived that. Kyle for Kelra. But at the end of the day, Fnatic Onyx still taking the Lord. It's an Enhanced Lord. Spawning at about now. Ian... I gotta tell you, Kelra's playstyle here, despite, you know, playing like a right click assassin, yeah. is this not a utility marksman? Is it, this not? A <laughs> it feels like it. Right, all he's doing is taking objectives, zoning out his opponents, and then look, he's no kills. He, 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 the initial burst, though, comes from Kelra. 
People sleep on how impactful it is to be on Marksman and plan it as a utility. Like everybody's like fancy, want all the fancy kills and slaying and stuff like that, which is cool. But in order to win the game as a team, you should prioritize just good gameplay and teamwork. The marksman's doing everything he needs to do. Kyle Tz found an angle to go right after Keller, and if they manage to pull things off like that and extend this game, they can create a comeback. But Fnatic Onyx knows this. That's why they're really aggressive. The gameplay is actually really good now. The gameplay is really good at pro level. I wonder if ranked is like this though. I haven't played ranked in a long time either. Like I feel like ranked is probably still gonna be buns, bro. Or maybe I got PTSD. I probably just got PTSD, huh? Ranked in North America is it was so horrible last time I played. We'll see what it is now though. Gold difference, man. At 10k. I just stopped counting. At 10K, 10K is crazy. 10K gold lead. Hunker down and get a free pick off. Rusko holding this bush like a champ. Gets pushed out by Ogwin and Flap. Yeah, fight. Did he get a purple? Did he get... No, he didn't. They're going to fight for the purple. It's crazy. 10K gold lead and you're fighting for a purple? I don't know about that. Waiting for the perfect opportunity because the AOG is going to connect. Frigid Glacier is there as well. well I mean, what you expect? Fighting for a goal? Fighting for purple? They got one of their players. They just got um the Theramus alt. Because the Fnatic push might just be the final blow to win game one. All right. Fnatic Onyx here. Uh, I believe the correct call for them would be to wait for the Lord. But they're just, up just applying enough pressure to FCAP. Just so that maybe this 10k gold is enough for them to deal enough damage. Yeah, from Ram is all down. The game right here and there. Okay. But wait. They, they might be able to do all something. Right. They're going to get this tower. I understand that FCAP are a world class caliber team. So they're not just going to suddenly do that. Yeah, plus uh, uh, three of their. Yeah, they ain't going to get greedy, huh? I like it. That That's a lot of self control. If this was ranked, if this was ranked, you're probably diving that going all in. But the fact that they, they played it cool. Didn't do too much. I like it. That's the discipline of a pro. I can see the great decision making that they're making. And the fact that they're doing this against AP Bryn, it shows you how solid of a team they are. Because we already know how crazy AP Bryn is. Like, they're a really, really good team. Like, one of the best ever. So, for them to be doing this, like, that's crazy. As impressive as that is... It just seems like you're just punching to the sky, hoping God feels your hits. You know what I mean? Because at 10K down, the map looking this blue. How do you contest? What's going on? Are they even thinking of contesting? Hey, look at just Brusco zoning out Kyle Teasy, making sure he's not going to be present during that turtle fight. A Lord fight in the Lord pit. But a Falcons AP brand making sure to try and move closest as much as possible to the Lord. Here comes the glorious oh. cutthroat. But it's not gonna break Almost got Kyle Here comes the clash. Feud, Almost got Cal Teasy. Still. Might be a counter attack coming in from Falcons. Might be a, this might be a free lord. lord. Okay, Cal Teasy. No, Cal Teasy is back full health. That's crazy. Skirt, plus the frigid glazier going to connect onto Flap Teasy. A lot of ultimates has been expended for both of these teams. Mm, okay. Now there you go. Connecting onto two. Marco Flap Teasy falls down. Yeah. Now it look like might be a wipe here. There's the Templars of Blades plus the push from Oh, with the push, the end of the game. Ah, the the uh, they just went for the end. That was a strong push, bro. I loved it. I loved it. This was actually a really, really great gameplay. Like, I love the way that this was played. This is really high-level play now. Like, this is very, very high-level play. Like, I used to compare it to League of Legends and compare it to other games, and Mobile Legends wasn't up to par. I feel like competitively, I feel like it was always cheese, and, and simple stuff would be would be you know tricking mobile legends players but now the gameplay is so complex and so much different stuff is going on i'm actually loving what i'm seeing here so yeah we're gonna be checking out more here on the channel be sure to subscribe all that good stuff let me know what else you all want me to react to and yeah i'll catch you all on the next one fam peace out y'all